it's me again. You weren't expecting this. I told you I'm gonna be daily vlogging. So a few days ago, I got coffee with my friend Saliana. We met at Starbucks at the mall that I'm gonna be working at, and she works there too, at Sephora. And I recorded all this while we were in Starbucks, but that footage is just noisy and stupid. So look, I'm re-recording this. She had all this stuff that she doesn't even use because she's worked at Sephora for like four years and they get gratis, which means free stuff. And anyways, she said that she had a few things for me. I was not expecting this. L look at this. I mean, do you see all this stuff? This, I... <laughs> All right, look, I'm sorry. I should have forewarned those of you, maybe with OCD, that my nails are a hot mess right now and they're all chipped and annoying. And I know it's a pet peeve for a lot of people. <sighs> turned on the camera and started recording before I fixed my nails first. So look at all the stuff at the new Marc Jacobs mascara. Too Faced Better Than Sex. This is the one mascara that she gave me that I have not tried yet. I didn't try this one yet. Baby Doll by YSL. I'm not even going to try to pronounce that, so I'm not. All the stuff. This is like, I don't know if you guys can tell, but I've been playing with makeup basically all afternoon. I've been playing with this stuff and... I'm gonna have reviews and tutorials and stuff with this stuff on JP Metz upcoming. But for now, I've just been playing with it. All right, this is a sample of Flower Bomb, which smells like heaven, literally angels. So I'm going to keep that for super special occasions. This is Black Tattoo Liner by Kat Von D. I'm actually wearing it right now. Guys, I need contacts so bad. I approve of this eyeliner. I'm going to keep using this eyeliner. Let's see, what other goodies do we have here? There's so many goodies. The best makeup haul ever. This is a shadow pencil by NARS. I have a teal one of these. I just did a quick swatch do on my hands and this light it looks more brown than purple But the lighting in here seriously sucks because all my lamps are upstairs very natural very pigmented Like I barely touched my hand with that this eyeliner is Smashbox and I've never tried Smashbox's eyeliners before But I'm really happy with this because first of all I really needed a brown eyeliner and second of all this this is an always sharp eyeliner It's the kind of eyeliner you just have to twist like you don't have to sharpen it or anything so I'm really happy about that one. Oh, what else do I have here? Like everything. Do you guys see all this stuff? Thank you, Saliana. Seriously, I know you're going to be watching this. Thank, thank you so much. This stuff is amazing. Now that's an, I already talked about that. Now this, this is a Bare Essentials lip gloss. And this tastes really good. It's kind of tingly on my lips, which I like. Actually, I'm wearing it right now. I don't know. It's hard to, this camera keeps going in and out of focus. See it? Like it? So while Soliana was looking at her stuff, we were talking on Facebook during this time. She was asking me, like, Justine, what do you use? Like, what do you need? And I was honest. I said I really only use concealer, like, under my eyes or if I get a pimple. And then I wear, like, a bronzer or something overneath. Like, I don't really wear foundation. So, and, and she's amazing. And the hookup is just, she gave me this Laura Mercier concealer. Which, this stuff, I mean, this is a tiny tube, but seriously, only a dab will do ya. It's very opaque, very smooth, looks natural, feels good. I'm wearing it right now under my eyes. And she also gave me this, the Stila Illuminating Beauty Balm. And this is basically the very sheer illumination on your skin. It's not even a tinted moisturizer, basically. And, you know, my sister's wrong. I'm sorry. Look, Erica, I know it's your birthday and you're probably watching this, but my sister was like, oh, this is a highlighter. No, it's not a highlighter. This is a sheer thing you put all over your face. Look, you don't know anything about this. I'm wearing it right now, all over. So this, if you do wear foundation, you would wear this underneath your foundation. And that's basically what I'm doing right now. I'm also wearing bronzer. I'm using the NYX Illuminating Bronzer. So yeah, I'm wearing that under my bronzer and my face just looks shiny and pretty. And this, I've used this before. I used this back when I worked at Macy's. The Lancome ladies would always give me samples of this. One of my favorite cleansers that I used at the time, but it's one of those cleansers that I would never buy for myself because it's a million dollars. It's nice and foamy. And this fresh, I've never really used fresh before, this company, but this moisturizer is really nice. I, I've been using this since she gave it to me. It kind of smells kind of funny, if I can be honest. It is a little stinky, but it's not like a bad smell. It's something I just had to get used to, but it feels really good on my skin. She gave me some makeup wipes, which is uh, Kat Von D. I've used this once. I used this the other day and it works. It wipes and they also smell really good so that's good and I am wearing this right now this is Stila uh, what color is this 
Indie, it's called. This is extremely pigmented. I was surprised. I put a little bit on my cheek and I had to wipe like half of it off. And I seriously just like dabbed it on. And that is pink, but it is pretty. It's like a shiny, pretty pink. And this is a mask. This is Glam Glow Thirsty Mud Hydrating Treatment. And I'll probably do a review of this. And that's about it. Look, I'm really hungry. I'm really hungry. I have to pee. This took forever to record. So. I'm gonna turn this off. 